Hello and welcome from Jakarta, I'm Mr Gary and in this evening's uh, live session we're going to be looking at munt as a suffix onto words. Now we've discussed last time we discussed prefixes and if you remember those are a number of letters that go at the beginning of a word to change the meaning, to alter its usage. This time we're going to be looking at some suffixes munt. Okay, munt, M E N T. And these words can be quite extensive. I've got a little quiz actually, and there are 20 words in there that are going to help you. I'm going to try and put these into context for you as well. So we can try and understand and use these words with a little bit more precision. So I think first of all what we'll do is we'll have a little spelling game. Okay, we'll have a little spelling game. I've got one organized for you. So uh, let's get cracking and we'll get straight into it this evening. Nobody in the chat just at the moment, only myself. So just before I do that, I'm just going to very quickly check that the stream is working perfectly. <laughs> If you're new here, you'll know that live streams are prone, shall I say, prone to uh, raw, uh, unadulterated slips, trips, mess ups, etc. And we have to try and make sure that obviously the output, that's the bit that you see, is acceptable. And the thumb I and make sure. Yes. Acceptable. <laughs> okay, chat, so I'm going to get cracking and get that sorted out for you. Just give me a moment or two while I do those things. Yeah, we're just waiting for a few people probably to come in. And I'll get... I'll, I'll just get those things updated as well. There's something that I need to set up and that's a thumbnail normally I have a thumbnail okay but uh, I haven't for some reason I haven't updated the thumbnail just a moment let's have a look where have I saved that okay uh, all right it's there it's in the screenshot thing right okay chat so just gonna get that thumbnail updated right now okay so hopefully when you go in uh, or when I go back people will know exactly what it is that we're talking about because that's what your thumbnails for okay uh, let's have a look well I don't I don't know what I've done with it just a minute <laughs> Yes, there we go, I found it. Okay, so thumbnail's updated. I forgot to do the thumbnail, that's so unlike me. Normally I do the thumbnail. First thing I concentrate on when I do live streams is making sure that the thumbnail's okay. Hello, Palavi as well. I'm so pleased you can see me and hear me clearly. It's always nice when someone confirms that. Okay, Palavi, so uh, only yourself in at the moment, so we're going to get on and have a little look at a game. We're going to look at some munt words, munt, and we're going to look at um, root words, and then we're going to see what happens to those words when we add munt onto the end. Now, normally these are verbs, okay, but they can they they are normally verbs sorry they are normally verbs so actions or states and i'm going to first of all tell you a little bit about the meaning of munt words okay because there is a meaning and it says the the suffix munt is an act of doing something or the result of an action okay you add munt at the end of the base word and then you can create a brand new word all right i'll show you this on the merriam webster uh 
It's called a noun suffix, is this one. Okay. Concrete result object. Yes. So that might be a little bit confusing for you, so I'm just going to make sure I can find the most simple explanation of this uh, particular suffix. Alright, so a suffix is just a bunch of words that we add to a word to change that word meaning. Alright, and we just spoke about what it means. So there we go. Okay. Now I'm just going to very quickly just adjust this uh, because it, some of it is um, in dark mode and it's not quite correct. So I'm going to just tell you a couple of things. I sure do get enjoyment out of going to the amusement park. Enjoy, enjoyment, amuse, amusement. All right, typical example. Groups of letters that are added to the end, a suffix cannot be used as a word by itself. It must be attached to a root word or a base word. You might hear that as, um, you know, uh, in the end of uh, the teaching material you might get. So, example, cement is not a root word, okay? Sorry, it's not an end word or not an end munt because CE on its own is not a word, okay? Cement spelt C E M E N T. So cement is not a word or a, a suffix word because CE on its own. The root word is not a word, okay? CE is not a word. So that's for the first thing. We can only add munt if there is a proper root word. A noun is a person, a place, or a thing. Verbs show us actions or states, so be mindful of that. Put the two together and you get a new word. All right, a new word. Munt. Let's have a look at some examples and I'm going to tell you a bit about this. Munt is a noun suffix, meaning it's added to what's usually a verb. Example, uh, enjoy, enjoyment. We spoke about that. An action of doing something or as a result of an action. Example, here you go. Enjoy is the base form of the word. Okay. And munt is added. So I like to enjoy or I, uh, I enjoy playing football. Becomes I take great enjoyment playing football. Okay. So this is really important that we um, we get these things correct and I'm I'm so sorry I'm just distracted by uh, yes it's a suffix it is a suffix that's what I'm talking about I'm talking about suffix words and I've got a whole bunch of things to show you okay so I'm going to just show you this very quickly and then uh, we'll move on. I've got a nice little game or two little games for you. And let me have a look. Yeah, I'm going to read this one. Okay. So it's explained that both the suffixes munt and ly start with a consonant, which means they can usually be added to the root of a word without having to make any changes. For example, the suffix munt to place gives us placement with the root word remaining the same all right so we can't change or won't change the root spelling the root word there is place all right place placement there are some exceptions to the rule such as when adding the suffix munt to root words that have more than one syllable and are a consonant followed by a y 
Like Mary, the Y is changed to I, giving us a word there, a very unusual one, merriment. You won't see many of those um, in munt suffixes, noun suffixes. But when adding the suffix to munt to argue, you must remove the E, giving us argument. All right, so no E in argument there. The focus, uh, when we, I mean, there, there are some LY focuses and things like that, but we don't need to worry too much about those because we're not doing LYs. We're staying firmly, firmly with munt words tonight. And like I said, I've got a little game for you. So we're going to have a little game and it's going to hopefully help you with this particular activity. All right then, let's go over to our game, and it's a little spelling game. Okay, I think we've played this before in Get the last ready to play game, so against I'm the clock. Right there, and you can see what I'm doing. Right, so here we go. We've got a delay of about six seconds, and it says Bob regretfully couldn't make the and uh, let's let me give you a clue Bob regretfully couldn't make the what what couldn't he make he couldn't make the oh look at that why isn't that working the, the answer on that one is Payment, all right. Pay the verb pay becomes payment, all right, becomes a noun. Let's check that one. Good, okay. Uh, I can't hear this for some reason. Let me have a look. Uh, why can I not hear it? Yeah. I'll just stop sharing that just for a moment, just while I figure out what's going on with that one. I need to figure out what's happening there. Yes. I can't, can you, aha. Let's try that again then. Maybe, yes. For some reason, I can't. <laughs> oh, that's so frustrating! <laughs> the game, one of the games that I've prepared there, isn't isn't working, chat. So uh, I do apologise for that. Uh, let me just get rid of that. Maybe I've got too many things open here, so I'll just um, close a couple of things down. Just make sure I'm not doing that anyway hello there Mohammed Ishmael good evening to you and we're just you're just joining us we've just been discussing how when we add munt onto a word usually a verb we can change it to a noun and then it becomes a noun all right so it has a different function a different function let me just have a look at this now uh, where are we and uh, there's a little bit of a <laughs> I'm having a little bit of technical, a few little technical problems, but I'm trying to get those ironed out just as soon as possible. So let give me a few seconds while I get that sorted out. Here we go. Where is that? Okay. I say sorted out. I thought, I mean, I was ready. You can always be ready and then you just get hit with something unexpected. And it, the unexpected thing was the volume. All right, so the vol the volume has caught me out. There we go. Oh. No, let's put that there. Put that there. I'll put that there. Where's that tab gone? Oh my god. Uh, there we go. Right, okay, so put that there. Right. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Right. No, that's that's still not worked. Uh, 
no, it, it seems it's it's not working. So let let me just figure out what's going on there. Okay, there we go. Okay, chat. Can you hear, can you see that now? Hooray! A few little uh, a few little glitches tonight. A multiple choice quiz with time pressure light. Yes, it's the usual quiz show that I like to play with you guys. I know that you like to do this one. So something that I created with earlier, uh, created earlier, should I say? Lots of examples. Now all of these, um, for some reason, chat. Can you hear the sound? No, you can't. Okay. Let me help you. A group of people who ro rule over a country. Okay. Are they govern? Is it the mayor or is it the government? A group of people who rule over a country. What's the answer to that one, chat? Any ideas? Government is the correct answer, I think, there. Well done. I don't know why, but I've got no volume on my on my end. I can't hear... I can't... Like, normally there are little sound effects and things. Uh, so I'm not sure. There's, a, there's definitely some sort of problem there. Anyway, number two. Let's get on with that. When someone gives money to a person or a company and expects a return on the investment... Is it an investment? Is it invest? Or is it invite? Hmm. I'll put a pause on there, chat, because I know you're got you've got a few second delay on me. And the answer Mohammed Ismail has said Let me have a look is investment as well Palavi gets that right as well so well done to the pair of you good job and the answer there investment guys well done okay now let me have a look we're gonna try and do the next one I don't know can I do that in full screen or not okay correct answer yes good job not letting me do that so let's click that again sorry about that chat I'm just trying to um, experiment with a couple of things making sure that it works when you get hired uh, so that should say by a company whoops typo from me uh, you enter what do you enter guys any ideas what you enter Okay, so let's say you don't have a job. Good, well done. Mohammed Ishmael says you enter employment. Uh, Pallavi, I think, says there, she says, I think it's she says, you also enter employment, of course. Good job, well done. The world of work is a difficult world, I'll tell you. <laughs> it's not easy. Work for yourself if you get the chance. Don't work for anybody else. Okay, a uh, little bonus round coming up, so we'll just fire through that. I'll try and help you get the maximum amount on that one. Okay, all right, there we go. I hope you're all having a good day out there. I've had quite a nice day. It's been a nice day. Um quite a straightforward day for me anyway right okay number four when you disagree with someone do you argue do you enter into an argument or do you battle which one is it guys which one is it any ideas Have a look at that. 
And I think the answer, Mohammed Ishmael, I think says argument. I'm not sure if anybody else is in chat, so I'm just going to go with the first correct answer that I can see. Uh, and the answer was argument, of course. Uh, ba root form of the word is argue. Okay, I don't like to argue. I don't like to enter an argument. When we do exercise, we can see blah, 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 blah in our bodies. Is it A, move? Is it B, movement? Or is it C, chat? Is it fitness? I'll wait, I'll, I'll wait, see. Yes, Mohammed Ishmael says there. He says movement. I think you're right. A nice, nice and easy quiz. You'll never get an easier quiz than this. Pallavi says movement as well. Well done to you both there. Good job. Let me go there. And I'm just going to highlight a couple of those answers as well. I've just so your names appear on the screen, etc. Uh, let's have a look. Okay. Yep, so good job to you. Well done. Let me help you read this. When you spend money to buy something, the seller receives the blah, blah, blah from you. Is it pay? Is it bank details or is it payment? Is it payment? Let me have a look. I'm just watching the chat here now. See if, see if I can. Um, Mohammed Ishmael says payment. He says payment. I'm just waiting for any other answers. Uh, Palavi is coming in as well. She says payment also. And I think, guys, your answer is spot on. Meaning perfect. All right. I think you got that one correct. Well done. Good job to you both. Okay. Let's have a look at the next one then. Oh, and we have a little bonus round. I'm so I'm so um, confused why my audio isn't isn't working at this point in the stream. I should be able to hear sounds like you sounds from the quiz, but at this moment I can't I can't hear anything. But, uh, anyway, here we go. Question seven. When oh should be when do people decide oh sorry when people decide that they accept something they reach uh, that's really bad another bad typo by me because I didn't have much time to check it all when people decide they accept something they reach an what do they reach when two people decide that they accept something, they reach an agreement. Agreement from both of you there. Well done. Uh, yes. Mohammed Ishmael Pahlavi as well. And there's no particular order. It's just whatever, whatever I see first. And I've made a terrible mess of this stream tonight. I've got windows all over the place. When... Uh, yes. I think I said that already. Agreement. Good job. Uh, yes, here we go. Okay, here we go, chap. Let's have a look at the next one. Uh, when we improve how something works, we say that it is, it should, it should say, it is called. When we improve something, we call it what? To improve something. Is it develop? Is it development? Or is it deteriorate? Uh, 
Okay, Mohammed Ishmael says development. He says development there. Is he correct? I'm going to wait a few more seconds on Pallavi. I don't know yet. Okay, I'm going to answer that one for you. Yes, she's got it right. Well done. The answer is development. Okay, development. My live streams are in development. I'm trying to improve them every time, okay, with new games, new things that we can do, we can discuss. And already I know something I want to develop next week because I've got separate windows and switching between them is a little bit awkward. <laughs> All right, here we go. Number nine, guys. Uh, when you are sure about something, you can make a blah, blah, blah to the press. Now, the press is like the media, so newspaper, television companies, internet news companies etc you make something to the press and uh, collectively they are called the press all right people who distribute and create news or report news they are the press and Pallavi say statement Mohammed Ishmael say statement also so let's just go there and check those good yep yeah, good Super job as well. I'm so pleased with you too. Mm -hmm. Always getting those. Uh, answers? <laughs> not easy. Yes, not easy when you, you've got... Live streaming is not easy, I'll tell you. Maybe I should just make more videos. <laughs> no. No, I think you like the live streams. I think you like it when you come. If you didn't like it, you wouldn't come, I think. And then I'd have nobody. <laughs> uh, let's have a look at this one. Um, he looked on in blah, uh, blah, 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 as he slid the ball past the keeper. All right. Um, is it a maze? Is it amazement or is it anguish? I mean, the clue is in the in the in the in the thumbnail, isn't it? You should all get the answers to this because we're always talking about munt. So any word that has munt in it. That's going to be the answer, isn't it, chat? Hmm? <laughs> uh, amazement. Yes, you can look on in amazement. Um, when you're really surprised by something, I suppose, you're just like, what? Okay, let's have a look at this next one. The win was a great blah, blah, blah. Is it achieve? Is it achievement? Or is it success? Achieve, achievement, or success, chat? I think that's right. Achievement. I've got achievement coming through there from both of you. So let's just. Uh, I'm just going to highlight a couple of those. Amazement, Mamid Ishmael. Palavi, amazement. Mamid Ishmael, achievement. And Palavi again, achievement also. So good job, guys. Well done. And I, uh, with regards to one of these questions, remind me later and I'll play a clip for you. There was an blah 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 in today's schedule or schedule, depending on how you want to pronounce it. Adjustment. Adjust. Ch 
change of pants. Adjustment. There was an adjustment. Correct. It means a change, doesn't it? A change to something. Uh, I think you're correct there. And Pallavi also says adjustment too. So well done, the pair of you. Good job. Okay, let me put that on there. That's, there we go. Right, good job. Uh, yeah, you're doing great at the moment. Uh, I have made this quiz, so I mean, if you want to practice it later. Uh, let me know in the chat. Uh, just say please. Let tell me the link for the quiz, and I'll I'll send you that. I'll put the link in the chat for you. Okay. Uh, I've lost the points. I think. Yeah. Whoops. <laughs> Whoopsie Daisy. <laughs> Let's have a look. Thirteen. I saw an advertisement for a new drink. Hmm. Whoops. I've not inputted that one correctly. The answer must be mint to advert. Okay, an advert is the base form of the word. Um, advertisement, yes, advertisement. Uh, or commercial break in the USA, they call it a commercial break. Hey, uh, we're gonna stop now for a commercial break. We'll be right back, folks. And if you see any adverts on this live stream from YouTube, tell me, okay? I'd like to know. I can't see the adverts. Uh, but occasionally YouTube might send you an advert on, and you might see... If you see one of those, tell me, okay? I'd be interested to know if you see any adverts on my live stream. I don't think you will, but you never know. You never know if you get any ads. Right, okay, guys. Uh, the judge handed out a harsh blah, blah, blah to the criminal. Uh, is it punish? Is it punishment? That's option B or C, time. Punish? Punishment? Or time. Mohammed Ishmael says punishment. You know what an advert is, an advertisement, right? It's like on YouTube, you might see them appearing at the bottom of the screen, they might appear at the side of the screen, or it might interrupt your stream with me with a full screen ad. Um, but yeah, if you see any of those, let me know. Okay. There's not a lot I can do about it, by the way, but it's interesting to know if you get any ads. I, I don't know if you get any or not. And if you get them, it's YouTube that's sending you them, not me. Okay. Punishment is the correct answer. So I'm going to just... Uh, yes. Palavi, punishment... Mavid Ishmael there. Punishment. Good job. Well done, guys. Okay. Okay. Now, let's have a look at this. Mr. Gary likes to give his students plenty of encourage encouragement Dancers. <laughs> you don't think I'm getting up and starting dancing, do you? Good God. You don't want to see me dance. <laughs> I can't dance to save my life. I hope you're finding that amusing, chat. I hope you're finding that amusing. <laughs> you don't want me dancing. If you want to see dancing channels, go look. People dancing, go for a dance. <laughs> go, go to a dancing channel. <laughs> I'm sure there are a few out there. All right, good job. Of course, 
Well done, Mammy Ishmael. Well done, Palavi. Both of you are correct. Encouragement. Nice spelling as well, guys. You're doing really well with the spelling. Not easy to, to type and watch and read at the same time. So some good, really good skills in play at this time, all right? So I'll try my best to get you 200. How's that? There we go. Okay, here we go. Next question! It's a big quiz, this one, isn't it? But so many mint words, and this is just a fraction, right? Yes! <laughs> this is a deliberate ploy from me. My phone is broken. I need to buy a replace. Replacement is option B. Or if there's anybody from Samsung in the next week or two, you might want to send me a Samsung S22 with 5G. So I don't have to pay for one. Don't pay for it when you can get it free, chap. Samsung Galaxy S22 uh, with 5G and Pala. <laughs> Not sponsored content, chat. Not sponsored content. Hint, hint, Samsung. Then I'll make some Samsung content. Uh, yes. <laughs> chat, well done. Replacement is the answer. I hope I hope I'm providing a giggle for you at home. You know, it's not uh, when you're doing these things. I think you've got to try and have a bit of fun, and uh, I threw a few fun ones in there, a, f a few fun options. Seventeen reading, sports, and games are all forms of. Entertain. Entertainment is B or C. Method of relieving boredom. What's the answer, chat? Any ideas? By, by the way, my hand phone, the mobile phone I use is about four years old. So. <coughs> Samsung, I need a new phone. <clears throat> Entertainment. Both of you are correct. Well done. Good job. It's not a D E. Not. I, I'm going to have to make these quizzes more difficult. I think for you guys. You're too smart. A withdrawn comment there, Palavi. I don't know what... Oh, yes, it's come back. I think maybe, it, like I say... Um, it's not easy, uh, it, you know, doing these things. Right, one day, I want a promotion to manage level, management level, or get less pay. Promotion means to go up, doesn't it? All right. Demotion is the opposite, to go down. But we're looking at promotion on this one, so to go up. Uh, Mohammed Ishmael says management level. And I think, yes, I'm just, I think there's another one typing there. Yes, I've got Palavi. Well done. Management level. And Mamid Ishmael management level. Good job, of course. We always want to work up the ranks. We never want to work down them, I'll tell you. You don't want to... If I'm earning one amount of money one year, next year I don't want to earn less. You want to earn more. That's the idea. I think. Do you agree? Chat, you can tell me. Do you agree with me or disagree? Are you in agreement, chat? <sighs> the, 
Now, this is one I want to talk about later on. Remind me about this. The football commentator yelled in excite. Excitement. Or glee chat. Excite. Excitement. Or glee. Oops, there you go. Whoa. To be careful, I need to get the yes. Mammy Dishmail says excitement, excitement as well. I I might play you an excitement clip before we go. I'd love to play a Leeds United clip for you, but if I did, I'd probably get hammered with a copyright, and I don't want the copyright on my channel at this stage. Not when it's growing, and it's not growing very well at the moment. So. <laughs> Playing in a team requires commit. Commitment or luck, chat. Commit, commitment or luck. Now, when you commit to something, all right, it means that you are you are dedicated. All right, you want to do that thing and do it well all right um commitment is the is the result isn't it so my commitment to you is i'll try and give you the best possible live stream as my viewers uh, my audience you keep coming in keep joining keep participating and hopefully these uh you know these give you some familiar familiarity with english make it easier for you maybe we touch on things that might be happening to your normal studies uh, when you're at college etc or school or whatever it is so yes that's the uh, that's the quiz for tonight girls and boys well done everybody <laughs> everybody girls and boys what am I talking about uh, well done everybody I'm so thrilled that you got that one correct I'm just going to uh, examine some of those excitement excitement okay now look at the chat all right look back up and I'd like it if you made three sentences with any of these mint words all right I'll give you a few moments to get that done that's a little task for you okay make three sentences with those words and i'll check them for you all right maybe you think you're you can do more than three and if that sounds like you you know go ahead you can put whatever you like in the chat um but i certainly think that practice makes perfect okay practice makes perfect and um, you know the more you do uh, the better you'll become the more you do the better you'll become so three sentences chat uh, show me that you can pick any three of those words and make a good sentence with it I'll read them out for you uh, you could do it uh, do it in three different three separate entries okay so sentence one enter sentence two enter sentence three right so then I can highlight each one on the screen for you uh, and if you do that you know it's gonna be good for you right I'll be watching the chat as well but in the meantime I'll just uh, summarize a little bit about suffixes and prefixes in this uh, in this live session so I'll be watching the chat as well guys all right obviously I need to make the content and it just summarizes and reviews uh, the things that we know all right so let's have a look So forming nouns using suffixes er, nus, and munt. Uh, example, you can add the suffix er to these words to create a noun to describe someone or something that does these things. 
Learn, learner, stick, sticker, watch, watcher, read, reader, climb, climber, cook, cooker. Okay, there we go. Uh, let's go to that one. Full screen on that one. So, uh, can you guess what these people's jobs are by reading what they do? Add a suffix er to doing verb and make the name their job. I play football. I am a footballer. I am a paint. I paint. I am a painter. I build. I am a builder. I farm. I am a farmer. I sing. I am a singer. I clean. I am a cleaner. All right. If you think of any others, Jack, put them in there. Uh, yeah, put them in the chat box. And I see a submission from Mohammed Ishmael at the moment, so I'm going to highlight those in a moment, all right? Um, yes, this picture amazes me. Amaze becomes amazement. I agree. The lady in the hat, she is in agreement. Uh, <laughs> I know I will achieve my goals. Achieve becomes achievement. I feel content. Now, content is another word for happy, isn't it? All right. She's very content with the job that she does. So just one second while I just <coughs> complete that at the moment. Right. Why does my dad always embarrass me says the girl in the bot at the middle bottom and she's um, she's suffering from embarrassment of course embarrassment uh, this cold water will refresh me a bit like an ice cream you need some refreshment chat you need some refreshment of course you do these children have been given special certificates for showing different qualities throughout the year. Can you work out what each quality is by adding the suffix ness? Ness. So a little bonus activity here, I think, in the stream. For being brave and bold, Christian is given certificates of boldness. All right, so being brave. For always being very helpful, Lara is given a certificate for her helpfulness. So that's a double suffix there, ness. And full helpfulness. Um, good for being lovely and calm. Aiden is given a certificate for calmness. For being a kind friend, Chantel is given a certificate for kindness. Kindness is very important and underrated. For always being smiling and cheerful, Derek is given a certificate for cheerfulness. Of course, he is. Well done, Derek. Uh, entertainment, yes, we've got there. Illness, fitness, shipment, of course. Shipment is one that we haven't come across yet this evening. Measure, measurement, all right. Loads of these mint words exist. Uh, I don't know if, yeah, we can't do that one. It, it doesn't, it doesn't, doesn't really work on this uh, system, unfortunately, of, of streaming. <coughs> but maybe we can do that next time. Okay, let's try and work out how do we stop that. Okay, cancel. Okay. Right, okay, so good job, chat. Well done. Uh, let me have a look. Now we've got some examples in the... Um, chat which are good I like examples we came into an agreement about the idea I wouldn't say into an agreement just say to we came to an agreement about the idea all right like the example we gave earlier we came to an ex we came to an agreement about the idea that's really good example though so not into just to on that one um, Pallavi says, I always get a punish, yes, you need a, a punishment, or, uh, I always get puni, yeah, you need a punishment, a punishment there, Pallavi, good job, well done, and then, thank, this is a good one, I like this, uh, thanks for the entertainment you've given to us, 
I hope I do make you smile or laugh when I'm doing my live streams. I think having a having a laugh and a bit of a joke uh, makes studying easier. I think, or learning easier. It makes it easier. It, it's you know, learning isn't easy. Whoever said learning was? I, I don't think I've ever heard anybody say learning is easy. It's not. It's not. You you learning is a lifelong journey. I'll say that much. Uh, so yes. Uh, we had a long argument on the issue, but in vain. All right, okay, good. So the argument went on, meaning it wasn't resolved. All right, both people couldn't resolve their differences uh, in this situation. This is a good. This is a good example as well. Loads of good examples coming in the chat box at the moment. Well done, you two. Excellent work. As we grow up, our development increases, of course. We're, we're, we're developing new things all the time, new skills, process, procedure, abilities, all right? The things that we are able to do, and uh, those are super important, I think, you know. Uh, don't think that, oh, I finished school, that's the end of study not a chance all right uh, a lot of teachers like me uh, myself around the world we regularly conduct training courses they send us on development workshops all of this sort of thing you know we could be away for a few days somewhere uh, in a hotel doing training or they call it cpd all right cpd meaning continuous professional development all right so even teachers uh, get sent to do uh, learning courses or topics uh, I'll tell you about the three that I've done this year <laughs> first aid uh, obviously I work with children right so I have to do courses about uh, child abuse and stuff like that you know it's a sad thing but it happens it happens around the world and and our school like a lot of schools these days address it uh, so there's that one fire as well so <laughs> a fire awareness course I'm not a fireman I'm a teacher but I have done fire awareness courses in the past and I did I have done one of those this year as well so three certificates I got this year for those things always look good on your CV your curriculum vitae or as the Americans would say resume all right uh, here's a good one movement is also found in plants well of course as the wind blows uh, the leaves the stems uh, branches if it's a slightly bigger bush they move had a bit of a storm here the other day uh, lots of movement in the shrubbery the flora fauna uh, locally here so that's a good example as well Mohammed Ishmael says I don't like my current job I need a replacement job you don't really go for a replacement yeah I suppose you I, I can see the I can see what you mean you wouldn't normally say that it's usually the employees the, the workers they are the ones who get replaced um, and, it, and that's to do with numbers isn't it yeah I, I need a replacement job I just say I need a new job there it's a good example it's a good example I like it so uh, well done for those examples you two and only two of you in tonight, so it was very nice, straightforward. Um, stri I say straightforward, goodness me, I was having all sorts of trouble in the beginning. Um, and then eventually we uh, we got there in the <laughs> We got there in the end. Hurrah! So good job, yes. Uh, so thank you so much for joining. If you have any questions, you know, you know what to do. Put them in the chat. I've been... Uh, I do enjoy reading your correspondence. 
All right. I do enjoy reading your emails, your comments, your messages, um, requests as well. I'm I'm going to be producing the next couple of live streams. I've got a couple of requests in from Palavi, so uh, you know those are those are in the works. Uh, I might even make them into videos. All right. So let's see how we go with that. Uh, any questions obviously you can just message me as, as per normal uh, for anybody else who's joining the stream we've got a subscribe button down here is there mm, yeah there press that red button subscribe I want more subscribers please <laughs> and if you uh, if you like to view anything else on my channel playlist up here little video down here Thank you so much for joining every, you two. Oh, achievement comes with discipline. You're right. We've got to be disciplined and we've got to try and maintain our standards and improve on our standards. I think you're right. Well done. Take care of yourselves, you two, and uh, I'll uh, you know, look forward to hearing from you. And I'll see you all very soon, maybe tomorrow. Have a great day.